Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're going to be playing Journey of Life. This is a game where you are trying to survive in a primitive world. It's actually current day, as far as what I've uh, read and what I've heard in my sound recordings, and uh, biplanes flying over and that kind of thing. But you are an engineer, and you... Oh, hey, okay. <laughs> You're an engineer. And you are trying to um, trying to survive out in the wilderness is what I've gotten from it so far. I guess I want to don't want to get rid of these bushes. They may may be useful. So um, anyway, let's go ahead and look at the crafting. Uh, there is no abilities yet. That is something they are still working on. And this is still an early access. So if there's any bugs or issues or anything along those lines, we will deal with them as they come. But let's take a look through here. So things that we need to worry about. We have craftables. We can make uh, S-Rocks and M-Rocks. Uh, and I guess these are the shapes that we're looking for as far as rocks go. They, um, let's see, so one jagged rock makes a sharpened rock with a high density rock. Tools, we have fire starter. I'm sure that's going to be a huge thing. Ooh, a backpack. We got the straight sticks for it already. We can make the fibrous rope. And then we need to look for allocation leaves. That'll give us more than four slots for our backpack. Weapons and so on. Uh, knife spear arrows that kind of stuff uh, we got axes hammers and um shovels and a torch stations we have a fireplace that takes six uh, high density rocks and then we also have a workstation which which takes straight sticks and fibrous rope and finally pottery which it looks like this is what's going to allow us to make some of our uh, need items like handmade clay pot that kind of stuff so all right so first things first we are looking for the uh, the backpack and the stuff to make a fire starter and then I guess to make the fire starter we're going to have to oh what are you broadleaf okay and you are a cocoa plant or a co co uh, coconut plant all right, so we're gonna look around. Uh, I think our primary goal right now is to get a backpack because four slots is just not gonna do it for us. Let's go ahead and craft some of these. And I am pretty much looking at every plant just to see what it's called. Um, allocation plant, okay, cool. Okay, let's take a look here. We have two allocations. We need to turn uh, plant fibers into uh, things. So let me go ahead and put some stuff on the ground because by what I read, you can actually harvest from or craft from what's nearby you. So we wanted to, we could put, oh, please don't tell me those sticks just disappeared. Oh, that's, that's hard. Okay, well, we're just going to have to get more sticks. Let's go ahead and craft some fibrous rope. well now that we there we go uh i think we got the sticks from these these the bushes okay we have two sticks let's go ahead and craft our backpack now And I guess the thing that we're going to need to make next is the wooden axe. Uh, because fire starter stuff, we're probably going to have to cut down some trees. Or I may have to leave this window open while I walk around just so that I can um, see what's on the ground. Because that is the thing. Oh, hello. That's a lot of slots. Let's go ahead and move that down. We also need to worry about food. Uh, what we should probably do is we should try to gather everything off of one of these and see if we can't just get the coconut at the very bottom. That doesn't make sense, but uh, maybe. Yeah. Oh, well, okay. I'm going to leave this stuff. That looks like it can make like a blowgun or something, but I don't think that's how it works. Let's 
put this down here that way when we get low on water I'm not really going to worry about it too much right now uh, but when we get low on water maybe we can um, all right yes I should go ahead and leave this open we're looking for high density rocks so that we can convert them in to uh, oh, and that's the one we need for the axe. And I think we need one for a shovel as well. Let's get some long sticks. Okay, we're getting a good amount of stuff here. A short stick. I don't know what that'd be used for, but we'll take those. And it looks like what we're going to have to do is make some piles. So high density rocks. Got some feathers. I'm not really going to worry about these. I'll take these. What is that? Blueberry seeds? Hello. We'll take... Oh, and that's... That's not going to allow me to stack on those. I kind of want to be very picky about... Ooh, um, picky. We need more high-density rocks, I think, than anything else. Feathers are a thing here, though. So that's good. Let's go ahead and get these high-density rocks here. And I think it said that for this fireplace, we needed six high density rocks anyway. So yeah, the more high density rocks we can get right now, can't that stack? You can, uh, the better, wait a minute, are those blueberries? Those are blueberries as well. Yeah, good. So we'll, we'll be stacking those up. And then um, I'm looking for S rocks, I think is what they're called. S rocks. I don't know how much I should be looking around here. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the plants in this area. What are you? Red berries. Okay. Red berries. Oh, and this one actually says how many red berries there are. So I'm guessing that if I harvest from this. Okay, that has red berries. If I harvest from this, I'm going to actually be destroying the plant, and I don't want to do that. So, I guess if there's visible berries on it, then we can harvest them. If there are not visible berries, then we harm the plant. So, this looks like a really good amount of stuff here. Let's go ahead and keep looking around. Okay, so I have the ability to go ahead and make the, the jagged rock. Let's go ahead and do that. Or sharpened rock. I'm sorry, sharpened rock. So there's that. We have those. I think I need to get. Wait a minute. What are? The, what's the axe made out of? Tool, axe, straight short sticks, and we get those from bushes. So hopefully, if I harvest a bush, should put the stick nearby. No, it didn't do it. Hmm. Okay, what am I going to put? I guess we're going to get rid of short sticks. And see what it gives me now. It's giving me fibers. Uh, maybe because I didn't have my hand open. Maybe I need to have, um, need to grab it with my hand. Okay, see that gave me a short stick. So we should be able to craft an axe. Let's go ahead and craft that first. There we go. We now have an axe. Come on. Get your graphics in line, my friend. And let's go ahead and cut this thing down. See what it is. It says it's yucca. I don't know what you would eat. Would you just eat that straight up? Or it looks like a leaf. Maybe it's kind of a leaf where you, you boil it or something. And you would eat the, the, the meat inside of the leaf. There's plants like that. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's see what we have here. So we have sticks, so we can get those, but no actual, no actual dry stuff. I was hoping because of the way that plant looked that there would be dry things. Hey, anyway. it's a cave. What are you? Okay, Shuffala, I guess that's how you would say that. Poisonous can be used to kill, um, to easily kill animals. Okay. Well, what are you guys? What's going on in here in this cave? 
Maybe this is a mine or something? Can I, can I target this? Limestone deposit. Okay. And then some kind of rock up there. I can't get close enough to it. So we may want to make our home here. Um, I don't know. Let's keep looking though. And I'm going to keep this window open just, just in case. We have enough rocks to be able to make the um, to make the campfire. Uh, I mean, I could go ahead and do that. I could lay down the campfire and get that started if I wanted to. Um, that is an option. Let's go ahead and head this way. Kind of stay along this. Ooh, another. Uh, this. I mean, we found some berry plants. And we're finding another fruit plant here. Uh, uh, lychee or licky, likey, lych, lych. I don't know. Anyway, another plant that has has fruit on it. Maybe a good place to to settle down in this area. Hey, I'm just looking for anything that doesn't look like anything we have already. Feathers over here. That's just a long stick. Look at these things. Whoa, whoa, hey yo! It's okay. What are you? Tell me your password. Okay, a tree can be chopped with an axe. Often contains resin. Okay, maybe. I wonder. I mean, it looks dry. I just don't want to waste trees. That, especially when I have a full inventory. Let's go ahead and eat this. Uh, our liquid was getting low anyway. Um, I can't get rid of blueberries. In, in my right mind, I cannot get rid of blueberries. Let's go ahead and uh, chop this down. See what kind of uh, items it gives me. Looks like it's giving me logs of some sort. Block. I hope they're not... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. A pine cone, very flammable and contains resin. So, oh, what? Did I get it? No? What are you? Pine block can be processed into gears, bowls, and etc. Ooh. And pine logs. But where'd that acorn? Okay, there we go. Let's grab the acorn. Okay, it's getting dark, I don't like that. I need to be leaving this open. Bamboo? Is that, yeah, it's bamboo, my friends! Cave here. I wonder if this water is is good or not. Plant uh, or uh, another fruit? It looks like oranges or something like that. Maybe not very many. I wonder if these grow. I mean, if they get bigger or anything like that. Okay, let's. I kind of don't want to mess with plants that have fruit until I absolutely have to eat them if there's like no other option all right let, let me see here let's go ahead and drink this i didn't get sick from it um and it is getting dark fast what are you clay okay Again, looking nearby. Let's 
chop one of these trees down. Maybe it has something we need. It has logs of some sort. Uh, that is so dark right now. Okay. All kinds of logs off of that. Oh, wow. That is dark. Wow, a lot of, whoa, hey, I think that's everything for it, yeah, okay, um, so we need to make this, what do I get rid of, uh, Uh, let's make this. It's going to give me room, right? No. No. Of course not. Let's make this. It's going to give me room, but not. Uh, I'm going to get rid of fiber. We see fiber all over here. Let's go ahead and give that last slot to fire starter. Let's go ahead and craft that. What? Oh, fire starter doesn't take any of this. It was, you know, we're gonna drop that on the ground. We're gonna take the fire starter. And it is dead of night now. Holy cow, I have no clue how I'm gonna find my way back. Well, we have bamboo here. It means we're close to the water. So there's the water. I don't know how much of this you can actually see. Um, well, a resurgence because of the moon, maybe? I don't know what's happening, but I'm going to take this opportunity. I, and then we're in the dark again. You know, we can make another fire. A fire is, a, is not something that is going to keep us from being able to do things. So let's, let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, come on, light. Come on, light of the moon. Do not fail me now. Alright, I'm gonna... Come on. I'm just trying to find a place. It is so hard to see anything. Okay, I feel like I'm on land here. I'm still moving. I'm moving to place. Okay, am I stuck somewhere? Am I stuck? Holy cow, this is dark. Okay, let me let me work on this for a second. Okay, all right. So, I'm going to put rocks in, in my primary here. And we're going to put a station down. I'm going to place it. And I'm going to try to place it until... Okay, there we go. There we go. I have no clue where this is as far as... I guess we'll put it right there. Okay, and then I think I have to okay, you need to place items. Okay, it's done. Now I need to put some wood on it. And skip this and do I just <laughs> fire okay let's take a look at our new surroundings we got a nice area back here that we can actually put a pile of stuff so I think that's what I'm going to do during the night uh, fire starter let's go ahead and put that right there put um, my hammer there I think I'm going to take the shovel you know, I really don't know what I could do with the shovel. Um, let's put things that I'll use over here. No? Doesn't want that. Doesn't want me to... And I lost it. 
Dang it. I don't understand that. That that went fine. That worked. So I need to go find some wood. Uh, let's put this here. And I'm going to go try to find some... Oh my goodness. Do I, I don't even have stuff to make a, uh, a torch. Let me go and see if I can't find some fibers. That's all, that's all I really need right now. There we go. Okay, that gave me the stick and the fibers. Oh, don't stand on that now. Craft. Why in the world would you not stack these? All right, now we'll make a wooden torch. Okay, how do I... I don't know why that worked, but that worked. Okay, let's see if we can't take the torch out of our main hand. And it's still working, our, it, and it works. Okay, good, good, good. Let's get a, an axe, I guess. Let's see, what do, I, what do we need now? We need food. So let's see if we can't find some food of some sort. Some more berries, I guess we could eat some of these, okay. Let's take this out of our main hand. So we grabbed all the berries off of that. Got some wood over here. Oh, we should probably get that birch. That birch is probably gonna be good for um, keeping our fire lit. Some more berries. All right, let's see how well these these work. Give about as much food as they give drink, and I'm out already. This looks berry filled. Okay, there we go. Our food and drink is is good to go. Um, this gives a false sense of of safety. I mean that that it's kind of light outside, but I bet it's not as light as it's as it's showing. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at crafting here. So we've made the axe, the hammer. We need to make the pickaxe, and this takes sharpened S rocks. And I think sharpened X rocks uh, mean that you need a jagged X rock, S rock, not X, uh, and a um, and another rock, the uh, high density. So let's go look for those so we can get a pickaxe. We already know where that cave is. Fishing rod, um, fiber rope, which we already have, and bamboo logs, two meter which we have right here 
Let's go ahead and put these in our inventory. Let's grab our axe out. Okay, let's make sure what we're getting. I don't want to waste trees now. So it's pretty much making me have to harvest. Right. There we go, two meter. Let's go ahead and craft that fishing rod. Now here's the question. How do you fish? Bait. What would you use as bait, I guess? Um... Can I use berries? I can't use these. Uh, what would I use? Oh, wait a minute, is this? Let's not waste the torch. Let's go ahead and get rid of the torch there. And I guess that whatever it is, it's not going to require me to have it in my hand. What if I use feathers? I mean... We found a lot of feathers coming through here. Let's get those. I thought I just saw another feather. We'll get some more long sticks. These are used for keeping our campfire going. Oh, it looks like there's a lot of them. There's some feathers. Rocks. We'll get those. Oh, we're getting all kinds of seeds. Now, I believe if we go into our technology tree. Uh, yeah, right here. Farm plot. We can make a farm plot. And I think that's just made on a sticks and um, sticks and um, just oh, just straight sticks. It doesn't take any fiber. And it looks like we can upgrade our campfire. Maybe it takes rocks. It looks like and some kind of dish or platter to put on top of it. On top of it. Smelting, we have a smelting furnace, and this looks like maybe an upgraded smelting furnace. Let's take a look here. Uh, that's what I'm going to guess. And then we have iron, copper, nuggets, copper nuggets, and aluminum nuggets. Okay. Farming, so uh, we are going to have to have a composter, it looks like. However the heck that works, so farming plots, we'll probably need to put three of them since we've now found three different plant types. But it looks like to get these, we're going to have to make the workstation. So let's see what it takes to make a workstation as I'm standing here and losing resources. Okay, so I need straight sticks, fibrous materials. That really shouldn't be hard with all the bushes that are around here. Uh, I have a lot of stuff on me at the moment, though. All right, let's go ahead and head back over to here for now. Mining is going to take a small backseat to just trying to get ourselves... Well, you know what I, what I may do is, I think in the technology tree, it also showed that... Um, smelting furnace, yes. And... Smelting furnace is um, under this as well. We may want to go ahead and just put this over there and and, um, and Get that stuff started, but for now I'm going to drop stuff off so we have some space in our inventory to start working on That kind of stuff so sticks and stuff. I'm going to just keep on me uh, but So we got some more seeds to put there we have some berries on us, so we can always eat those. Keep those sticks here. These sticks here. These are all for for the cause of uh, 
keeping our fire lit at night. Berries we'll take with us. Axe we'll take with us. Just take these. And then let me put the fishing pole in my hand real quick and see if feathers work. They do not. So I'll put feathers down here as well. Alright. I guess I don't need to take my fishing pole with me. Uh, because we're going to try to get this thing situated. So, uh, just playing the game so far, I like the ideas that it has. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of wondering how this composter is going to work exactly. I mean, am I going to have to go and just grab all kinds of plants uh, and just have them rot? How long does it take for those plants to rot? That kind of stuff. That's what's going through my mind at the moment. Okay, oh, uh, give me that rock. Rock, give that to me can never have enough rocks oh you know what I'm doing passion up all the things that can actually give me sticks right now and we need I think it said like 10 or 15 of them gonna grab them until I can't anymore and then I guess we'll get some fibers as well the gift that keeps on giving 4 8 math 12 16 I think we have enough okay I'm gonna go ahead and grab some fiber grab some more here I think we're good yep all right so we'll make the workstation oh did I bring I did I make the hammer I bet I have to have the hammer I'm gonna leave the um, I think I'm gonna leave the shovel over here because this is where I'm seeing all the clay anyway and the shovel is for clay so I'm pretty sure I made the hammer. So let's go ahead and swap out this for the hammer. And you know what? You know what? Okay, we're good. I do have endurance. I'm seeing my endurance go down. Let's go ahead and eat a little bit get our stomach back to full because I'm seeing that no matter where we go or no matter what we do um, we're gonna be far away from things so I could either put like a camp up here because I do have the abil ability I think if you press T to build buildings I don't know how well this works or what kind of materials it would take to build these buildings but at least I could start building a building and then like have it halfway between so let's try this out see what it really takes for us to do it I'm gonna oh uh, actually I can remove this one uh, let's go Z see it oh yeah Z There we go. Turn Z back on. Boom. Okay, can't place here though. Let's go ahead and let's see. E, Alt, scroll. Okay. Put down some of these. Let's put down the one there, 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 there. There. Yeah, I think that's it. And then Alt scroll again. Wait a minute. How do I get like windows and stuff? There's a door. How about I have a door? 
can't play this it requires pillar times two support there is pillar times two support okay oh wait a minute i'm confused all right um oh, this is the actual door boom what you're just gonna straight up give me the door okay I have no clue what, what this is going to take to get done. Ooh, we can get some wide windows going. Boom. Why not? Why not have it spacious? And then, uh, let's see here. What do we got here? Is this ceilings? And then, not really gonna worry about roofs so much. Can I, can I, sh what is there a, a way to shift, rotate, shift R, uh, scroll to change? So I can't even get like a regular. Okay, there we go. We got connect, connect. Can't place here. Can I place here, maybe? Can't play. Okay, I can place there. How about we just do this? There we go. We'll put make this the deck, and this is where we're gonna actually have our have our stuff. I'm not able to actually get up on there, so. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Put a regular wall there. Regular wall there. And then we want to put another door in. Put one of those. Is there different variations? And then we'll put that there. I have no clue how hard this is going to be to make. I'm sure it's going to be absolutely insane, but we have something. We have a structure started. So there that is. What do we need? Planks. Limestone brick. Oh, but I can get it. Are you telling me? Wait a minute. Are you telling me I can actually walk on this now? No, it's going to walk through it. But I still have a door. I have a door that's visible. Okay, so this is definitely stuff that comes later. But, hey, we have stuff. And why is that limestone right there? Is it because of the choice I made out of it? Or, I guess, this is probably stone as well. Alright, anyway. It's here. It's in the world now. I have this place. Uh, the question is, you know, it's been a nice, nice day, so we may be able to, but I think for right now, I'm going to have to go with the workstation being over at the mine, uh, and then we're going to have to get to making the furnace and all kinds of other craziness that's going to be happening. All right, let's see here. So first things first, we need... Drop that right there. And put the hammer in our hand, I think. Station. Works that wait. Station. Workstation. Two fibrous rope. Oh. Let's make those. All right, uh, for this, I guess we'll put this right there. Oh, we have more than enough. We are golden here. Okay, so we have that. Uh, I'm gonna put sticks down. Don't you two disappear? Come on, why are you disappearing? Oh my goodness, that is so frustrating. 
put those, let's put the rope down. You better not disappear torch on me. The torch really isn't going to help me if I, uh, if I don't have fire and whatnot. So let's go ahead and take a look here. I got to get a pickaxe stuff started. That takes those rocks. Those, what are they, S-Rock? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm just saying all kinds of stuff flash across my screen here. Uh, High-density rocks to convert S-Rocks. Those are M-Rocks. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, I, yeah, there's an S-Rock right there. Just goes by so fast. Mushrooms? Maybe? Yeah. Take those. High-density rocks. We're going to make a second campfire. Like <laughs> It looks like is what we're going to end up doing here. High densities. Give me some S rocks. I need S rocks. You don't want to give me those S rocks, do you? M. Come on, M rocks. I don't need you. So I need to check the fire starter because if the fire starter actually gets, uh, takes damage, because I think everything takes damage as you use them like that. Um, then we're going to have to try to keep campfires going. We're going we're gonna to have to try not to let them go out because that could be our survival. Okay, let's take a look down here. Oh, S rocks. Give me some high densities. There we go. There's another one. I'll take another S rock just in case. All the high densities. All right, let's craft these. Uh, I, you know what? I don't have the stuff. Uh, let's go back. Go ahead and eat the rest of these berries here. Ah. Let's grab another coconut while we're over here. Just so that we don't have to go through anything else. Okay. Throw that out. Throw that in. I guess we'll drink it because we're pretty we're pretty low on water. Uh, not that we can't get more water because we found that stream. Of course, I'm sure it's not going to stay good water. Uh, I'm sure you're going to have to boil it at some point. But we now have the stuff to go ahead. Wait, is that more mushrooms? Let's get those mushrooms. Oh, uh, you can only carry three at a time. So it says they're edible raw, but it says you also can make a stew. A stew would be pretty cool. Alright, we're back over here. So we have the cordage and everything. I think we should be fine. We just gotta make these S rocks here. Go ahead and do that. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do wanna make those. Okay, that leaves us with two jaggeds. Or two sharp, right? Two sharpen. Four sharpen. Okay. We sharpened all of them. But we still have six high densities. And that's all that really matters right now. Alright. Let's make our pick. 
and then we'll put any other high densities over here. Put our axe over here. Uh, rocks. Uh, because, oh, we're going to have to make a campfire. That's right. That's what we're doing. Put some mushrooms over here as well. Alright, let me go ahead and go get the fire starter, and then we'll start working on the fire. Also, I believe we have some long sticks over here somewhere uh, that will allow us to keep our fire going once we get it started. How are you going to lose for? Yeah, there we go. I think that would be enough for right now. Some more mushrooms. Take those. How do, how do I move like slate and it just goes away? That's going to pick up that flat rock. Okay, there's the yucca tree and some fibrous just white in there. Alright, let's head back. Let's head over. And then maybe we'll get the stuff at some point to be able to build that, that house and maybe put a roof on it and maybe expand it from what it currently is and also get rid of those stone uh, stone walls because definitely do not want stone walls. Though the limestone might be the better way to go. You never know. I mean, that, that might be the best, best route. I'm going to grab some drink while I'm over here as well, so that we're hydrated and ready to go because the night time will be upon us, and we only have mushrooms right now to keep us alive. Uh, though, ooh, I should probably pick up some clay while I'm over here too. I don't know what all this, um, let's get that, get our fire starter, how much clay do you think you would need, right, let's put that there, actually let's pick and put that there and we'll get a, we'll get three stacks, three stacks of clay, and then we'll come back for these, um, the next day so that we can how does this work it's like I'm a, a mining <laughs> pretty much mining clay I wonder how much this is going to give me Also, right now, the game isn't uh, uh, generated with the ability to um, go to other biomes, as far as I know. So I'm, I'm wondering how much actual materials are on this island. And can I travel to another island? Uh, because they haven't said if that's even a possibility. Alright, let's see. We can get four per stack. Um, and we have a lot left there, so uh, it looks like we're good to go. Uh, do I want to leave this over here, and I can maybe pick up some more because that's that's taking up both hands. So let's go ahead and put that down. Yeah, it looks like I can get two more stacks. So we should be good for clay for a little bit, and we still have a lot to go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe the water back here at the end of the spring is best for us to drink. Alright. Getting dark again. I do not want to make a campfire in the dark. Though I can move the campfire 
Uh, so that shouldn't be a problem. Just want to kind of get there uh, when it's not pitch black dark. And my, my stamina is a thing. <laughs> it's definitely bothersome. So I, maybe what I should end up doing is picking like, I don't know, five or six coconuts. They seem to give you a good, huge amount of nutrition. So why, why not? I gave me three of those fruits. Let's see how good these are. And I have seeds for those too. Oh, I gotta put something on the ground to eat them. And it's getting dark again too. Let me get these. I'll uh, eat these. Wow, that's like actually a good amount. But it, I'm putting myself in a situation where it's going to be too dark again. Or maybe not. Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's already really, really dark. Here's the table. Oh, my gosh. I just, this, I make this harder on myself. The other thing is, is I'm about to put stuff down on the ground. I'm worried I'm going to lose it. So I'm going to pick up all these. Uh, I got those sticks. Look at how dark this is. Let's put this right next to the cave, I guess. Station. Place this thing. We know how this is done, so that's going to be easy. And I can actually start mining at night, so that's going to be good for us. Let's go ahead and put some of that in there. Or that. And we got fire. Wow, that really centralizes around that one spot. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm actually standing right on the thing. So let's, uh, let's put this down. Don't you dare get lost. And we're, okay, I got the pick on me. Oh, the pick takes up two spots. Let's put that down. I'll put this down for now. Put these guys over here. All right. Okay. So we got limestone. <laughs> oh, it looks like it deforms too. That's pretty cool. On a limestone here not a lot not not as much as I thought maybe only only eight limestone from that and I can't see anything over there so I think what we'll do is we'll end the video here we've gotten not very much done we got two campfires in the day we we're able to get a workbench we didn't even take a look at the workbench how could we do that man how could you let me do that Okay, so it looks like uh, it gives us abilities to make more items than we currently have. And it looks like I don't have to have the items equipped for me to do it. Uh, the only thing it adds for the tools is ladders. Craftables. Ooh, I can make a stone wheel and a pottery wheel. So we gotta make this. And that's made out of flat stones. So we're gonna need two flat stone for that. Looks like we can make cloth. I don't know what that would be used for. Uh, weapons. The only thing I'm... Ooh, poison arrows. But here's my question. Because 
uh, if I use poison to kill an animal, what's it going to take for me to get that poison out of the animal to be to make it edible? You know, I don't know if that's a thing, uh, but if it is, <laughs> and then here we go. Here's our actual new workstation. So we have a farm plot, nine sticks, easy to do. Water collector, that we need to do. Collects water on rainy days. I have not, it hasn't rained yet. <laughs> You need to place a clay pot under it, or otherwise the collector, uh, collector water goes straight into the ground. That may not be bad if you put it over a farming plot, though, eh? Um, farming plots. Plant your ref um, preferred tree, uh, preferred seeds into it, and take care of them to watch them grow. You need to fertilize them with compa uh, compost and keep them watered. Okay, and then the composter uh, used uh, used for making uh, compost from rotten fruits and unusable leaves. Okay, a dock. What? Play. Okay, maybe we'll be able to make a ship. I don't know if that's in the game as of right now, but we can try to get to a point where we're able to do it. Um, smelting furnace. This is where we are right now. So we need to make an air chamber, but we can't make that until we have a pottery wheel. Um, but air chamber, we have the clay for it. Uh, we are going to need tin clay, 15 high density stone. We'll have to go out and find that an ore crusher station we're gonna have to make this I'm guessing as well and um let's see a smelting pot probably and a casting tunnel uh, but yeah it's looking like we're getting to a point where we're able to move into that next step now what else is I'm noticing is that at some point we can go ahead and upgrade this we could probably upgrade it right now but if we upgrade it now uh, it's probably not going to be a good idea. Oh, and our... Oh, please, hopefully that is still... No, no, no. Take you out of there. And that's still going? <coughs> it is. Okay, good. Let's grab up all, the, all those... And we'll try to keep that lit. But anyway, anyway, <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you think about the game. I think that it should be a pretty interesting game. Uh, we need to get to a point where we can get ores, iron, that kind of stuff, and then move on to smelting, maybe making a boat, making a house, getting everything moved over to the house so that we don't have to live like. Uh, savages and um yeah let me know what you think of the game thank you so much for watching this is cypher deck you guys thank you for everything you do for me and uh liking and subscribing that that helps me a lot and um yeah see you later peace out